2017 Fury NM1 rotary engine hybrid motorcycle. French startup Fury N is currently seeking funds for its rotary engine hybrid motorcycle, called the M1. Rotary engines for motorcycles are not a new idea, of course. With Suzuki having the first mass market rotary back in the mid 70s, the Reed 5, and Norton in the late 80s with the twin rotor Commander and F1. There is a lot to recommend installing the rotary engine in a motorcycle. The engine is small, light, and runs smooth, and lends itself well into bike's overall design package, giving a lot of power for a reduced amount of cubic capacity. Though this doesn't hold true these days when you have 600cc inline force pumping out close to 120hp. The flip side, of course, is the rotary's reputation for eating rotor tip seals, burning lubricant which then leads to poor emissions and a penchant for guzzling fuel. For starters, the Fury NM1S power plant is a 654cc to X327cc rotor wackle engine that puts out 125 hp at 9000 rpm with a torque figure of 105 Nm at 6000 rpm. This is coupled to an electric motor federal by lithium sulfur batteries that is rated at an equivalent 55 hp and 100 Nm to work giving a final figure of 180 hp and 205 nm. This makes for some very impressive numbers, when compared to what Furian claims is a 209 kg wet weight for the M1. The engine is suspended in a trellis frame, and interestingly, the call-out drawing for the M1 shows a Stirling cycle engine mounted in the lower front half of the chassis, suspension is with 43 mm diameter upside down forks, fully adjustable for rebound, compression and preload, while the rear is a horizontally mounted monoshock, adjustable for preload and rebound. Fuel for the Fury NM1 is carried in a 16 liter tank, while seat height is set at 810 mm Fury and claims the M1 will be able to travel over 400 km on a single tank of fuel, which gives it a very impressive range compared to typical sports bikes. The brainchild of designer Mark Evness and four-time supermoto champion Adrian Chirer, the M1 currently exists only as pixels on a computer screen. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.